Hi, I'm Bill Sargas. Welcome to this episode of Let's Play WoW. I'm uh, doing a, a Disc Priest thing. Um, in, I'm doing the, the Vision. <clears throat> my uh, my sister has a, a priest and she, she also plays Disc. And I was telling her how I, how I um, you know, was doing things and, and she was like, I can't quite duplicate. I, don't, I can't quite exactly see what you're doing. So I, I thought I would make a video um, just to illustrate what she does, how I can survive. So we'll do a couple of things here. First of all, we're going to do this um, vision of Twisting Sands. We're going to do this vision thing. And, um, of course, pick up We the will quest. persevere. Hold your head high. So I have all my stuff on my action bar, and I've moved all my action bars over. This is a helium add-on. This has got uh, my healing spells, the haze pressure, purify all those things. Um, I have a macro on um, this is the power word shield. Uh, I have it macroed so that I can cast it on whatever the mouse is touching, um, including unit frames that sort of thing but um, in, in in the case where I'm playing by myself obviously I want I want it to to bubble myself I also have talented and done everything in order to get penance as um, do the most damage and the most healing possible so that's the way I've set up the um, uh, as right gear and all that stuff so anyway uh, penance is is kind of my go to on the damage and healing. Also I have uh, my psychic screen on my what my normally is my interrupt button and that plays into survivability a lot as well. So let's go in I have to get solar so it's it be I've ran this a couple times already today on other tunes, and it really kind of depends on how many other people are in the instance with me. I'm also talented to go faster with the, the bubble on. And here's one. And there's another guy over here, so I'm going to have to take this guy out. I have the blowback. Somebody, somebody uh, rescued my guy. Demon Hunter rescued my guy while I was fighting. So 1300 DPS is not super awesome, but uh, it's it's enough for me to be surviving and uh, getting stuff on the wall. Kill these two guys. As I can. That's a very switching targets. Bubble one. Penance. Loading back. So 9,000 DPS, not super impressive, but I came out of that with full 100% health. So also, you know, that's not a bad outcome. The best strategy in an instance like this where there's other people is to just dot things that other people are fighting. And, uh, but I don't have to kill anybody for this. There's one of these quests where you have to kill 20 things. I usually just try to find like a demon hunter or somebody and just follow them around and dot everything. But I need to find more people to rescue. 
That is not. That is, that is play. That was another day, not a problem. Fire mage somewhere. That's my brother in law. Oddly enough, that's my sister's husband. He's in, um, he's in, um, War mode, so I can't bubble. It. So Teresa, there's your, there's your husband. Hope he's not supposed to be doing chores or something. I had this problem on my, I had this problem on my, my on Kadosh earlier, and everybody was. Uh, Oh, there's a guy. Oh, everybody was already rescued. So Eliz has uh, 439 score. She's on level level five on her cloak. This guy. This guy has to die now. Wow, he's evading. I scared him off. back and I don't know look I got that Let's see I need four more four more souls it was um Knowing where to look is half the battle. Two more, two more. So here's a couple guys up here. I'm gonna dot them both up. Taking some damage that time. Oh, there's a guy. Can I get to him before? Obviously, you have to play a lot more deliberate. I do not know. Not a ridiculous person by nature. All right. I need one more, and then I will do like a running out of sanity. Oh, can I get there? I doubt it. Yeah. I need some time. So this has got a little like. So they'll be back. So I dotted them both up, bubbled, blew them away. Somebody else. And I'm just I almost never, I almost never do a smile. There seems to always be a better choice. going but on these things where there's a timer on them it's sometimes a challenge yeah. there was some ice all right 
right. He's dead. Also have you know desperate prayer, pain suppression, and fade. Which to some degree or another, sometimes actually. Fade is not ever not really been my most effective spell over the years that I've played this. But having, um, I use um, move anything, put everything up on the side. And that is kind of, I don't know, how I play a disc priest. A lot of, of avoiding Trouble, bubbles, of course. B using the shining force to blow them back. Using the fear to uh, to run them off, and then just being patient enough to you know to get by on a third of the DPS of a different class. Um, I'll do another video where I will go do the uh, horrific vision, but that will be not the signal. Hopefully this uh, gives sort of a little bit of insight into using the Disc Priest. Glory to the Sindora. Uh, current content, obviously. Stay the course. And, uh, yeah, that's that. So thanks for watching. Please click the like button, subscribe to the channel, sign up for notifications, leave me a comment, question, or suggestion. That is all for this episode. Let's see, do I have bow over here? No, I have to type it. There you go. See you next time.